arrived from the garden centre, delivered. What we're going to do with this is plant it in our aquarium. Look how beautiful that is. So I'll take a cut and I'll show you how to wash it out. So I'm just going to take the salvia off, the golden pothos. It comes with the tub. So I'm just going to tip it over into the box. And you can see all these beautiful roots. The root system in these plants are amazing. So I'm just going to take all the mud out and then I will show you how to clean it. Try and keep all the mud inside the box because we don't want to get this over our kitchen or utilities area. Beautiful, beautiful root system there. Okay, I'll get back to you in a minute with the, the washing out of the soil. So I'm just going to start washing out all the soil in the hand basin. You don't want to get this soil down your drain pipe because it will clog up your system underneath the sink. So always use a basin and if you're lucky enough like me, your wife won't mind you using her hand basin. You can wash all the soil out. There may be snails in here. Snails are okay for your tank but you don't want too many in because they can breed like mad. So give it a good, good wash. And then you separate them. And I'll cut for now and I'll show you when I've separated them so you can see what they look like. Okay, now I've washed the mud out of the roots. We've got one, two, three, four, five plants from that one plant pot growing. The roots are amazing. So the next stage is plant them. See you in a bit. So I've just laid the pothos plant roots just inside the tank there so it can get used to the water. And the pothos plant actually reduces nitrate levels in your aquarium and also it reduces algae growth. That's why I want to put it in there. Plus, it will give a, a good look to the tank as well. Cost around about cost around about eight pounds, which is about ten dollars. Now we've also got some plant holders here. Now these cost about four pound for about twenty, which is roughly about you know five or six dollars. And this is what they look like. I'm just going to show you how to, I'm going to demonstrate how to put it together. So you just take the little bungee then you just put it through a hole that's in the plastic sucker and the plant goes into here. I'll put these around the tank and show you how it looks later. So there we have it, the pothos plant has now been put into the aquarium, we'll give you an update in a couple of weeks time and we'll let you know if they've taken okay. And just to end off, the pot that came in, the pothos plant and the soil, I've reused it for my son's sunflower, so everything is recycled and everything is used.